never stops. Still working in Korea. Unfortunate revelation last night. I realized that I've left my glasses in the Airbnb and unfortunately they couldn't find it. I don't know what happened to it. So I have to get new glasses today. That's the first thing we're doing. And I have my lovely translator here with me. Translator for hire. How much am I paying you? I get paid in love and uh, happiness every day. So yeah. <laughs> um, anyways, we're on route to get the glasses. But that's the start of our day. Which I don't know which thinking? one. Okay, I'm gonna get this one. Then. Okay, get it. Okay, set. restaurants in Korea is a lot of it is specialized so this place has only three items on the menu and then the cold noodle place we went to yesterday only had cold noodle options and manju on the menu so I think that's kind of cool but this is really good Good morning! I feel like I've been waking up so early because I'm still on New York time and then also I just wake up and I'm scrolling my phone because I'm just catching up on everything and I'm responding to messages from my parents and sending them photos and then I'm calling my parents too in the morning hours when they're awake as well. I've been getting very exhausted by the time it hits 5 p.m. here but I'm trying to turn that around. It is currently day three, and we are getting ready to go to Gangnam. Gangnam. <laughs> and we're gonna head out really soon. Um, our Airbnb is so cute. I don't know if I did a tour yet, but we kind of made the place a mess, so. <laughs> oh, 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 fuck Gangnam style. You're gonna get canceled. I'm Korean. Are you? Say something in Korean. I'm a Korean person. Hello. Hey. They're gonna be like, he doesn't speak Korean. <laughs> what? what do you say before you eat in Korean? Chai. Bok gesunida. Bok gesunida. Your Korean viewers can translate that for you. <laughs> I don't know what you said. We're getting some breakfast this morning at Adia Coffee. We went to Paris Spaghetti uh, yesterday morning for breakfast and it was so good. So my expectations are high. Also, we've been running on coffee every single day and I don't know if that's good or bad, but we definitely have jet lag, so we need it. Okay. James said that no one's gonna talk to us in Korean today because of what I'm wearing and my tattoo, which is starting to fade. I don't know if you can see. It looks kind of, yeah, it looks kind of bad right now. But I don't know how to get it off or get rid of it. So, um, yeah, also, we got condensed milk latte with the extra size, and I didn't realize it was this big. Literally, the size of my head. But we're gonna go to Gangnam, which is, I think it's known to be a more luxurious area, and there's a lot of shopping. So, today's gonna be a window shopping day. Are there lactic? Hello. Hi. No, I don't think so. Anything you want to say? I'm scared right now because I'm lactose intolerant and <laughs> we, we have a lot of milk here, so... Wait, there's so much sugar though, I don't know if I can drink a little bit. Alright, 
Alright, I'll Anyways, see you guys in Gangnam. Today we are in Apgujong, which is a part of Gangnam, and it's a very good place to shop. Very hip and trendy. A lot of cafes and clothing stores and stuff, so we're gonna just look around for a bit first. And then get some katsu, maybe? Yeah. The katsu place we are going to was recommended by one of our friends who lives here, and she said it's the best katsu in all of Korea. So. Maybe not Korea, but okay. Seoul. <laughs> Yes, I do want one. We should get some. <gasps> so Oh, no, no, no. Good. Thank you. Everyone thinks I'm Korean. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the Just opening the with Annyeonghaseyo. Is my pronunciation good enough for them to think that? It's though? like, because you're not saying it extremely loud. Oh, it's yeah. It sounds like it could be native. <laughs> good job. I was so like shook when he asked me like a full sentence. <laughs> the whole sentence, like, and he's like, like what? he's like, do you want this in a bag? And you're like, oh, I don't know. <laughs> to go to Namyeonjun. It's a city right outside of Seoul and we're visiting James's family. I'm excited and nervous because I met them for four years ago. I think they liked me but it's been so long and I feel like I've changed as a person too and my hair is red so I don't know what they're gonna think. Also I have still remnants of my fake tattoo on. I took this one off last night because it was already coming off but yeah. We are also going to be spending the night with James's aunt. So we're not going to be in the Airbnb tonight. So we also need to pack a little before we go. We woke up at 7 this morning just so we could get ready. And it's almost 9. So I feel like I'm kind of in a rush. But I'm very excited. Also, I have been using this eyeshadow palette that I got from Cleo. It's called Nap and Cheese. I think that might be the collection name, but it's so cute. And the colors are very nice. Some very light colors. Also, I forgot to bring a compact mirror or a an eyeshadow palette with a compact mirror. So I've been doing my makeup on my eye eyebrow palette mirror. I don't know. It's so small though. It's like the size of my eye. Anyone knows how to contour a bulbous nose, please let me know because I feel like it always, whenever I try to contour it, it accentuates the little bulb that I have. So I don't really know how to do it. And I started just doing the contour on the bottom and then evening it out. But I feel like it just looks like a little garlic. Shrantopi is what they call in Chinese. My makeup is now done. 
Also, these are the new glasses. I lost my other glasses, but they're actually really cute. And I think they're the same color. I couldn't tell at the optometrist, but I think they're the same color as my hair. So it's slightly brown as opposed to just black. I think they make me look a little cutesier. So I do quite like them. And then it fits the hair very well too. So James and I each brought a check bag, but I also brought this carry-on from Manos. And thankfully I did because we are going to Nam Yanju for a day. So we all need to pack some stuff. And I am not just saying this because they are sponsoring the video, but this is probably the most amazing piece of luggage I've ever used. And I never understood the hype around Manos bags until now that I have one. I literally, on the way over, from New York. I couldn't stop telling James to just roll this because it literally feels like you're rolling a suitcase on air. So this is such an upgrade for me too because I am just so used to two-wheel carry-ons. I've never had a four-wheel carry-on and it just feels so much nicer. And I'm also used to the suitcases that my parents had brought over when they first immigrated from China. So a lot of the suitcases that I used growing up were just a lot older and run down and the wheels were like sticky. So yeah, this is amazing. These suitcases from Manos are very lightweight and sturdy because they make it out of an aerospace grade polycarbonate material. So it's pretty much impossible to break these. And the suitcase that I've picked has this compression pad at the very front here. So you can put all your stuff under it and then tighten this. They also have various other travel items from everyday bags to luggage. So if you guys want to check them out, they're a sustainable brand. They're climate neutral certified, which makes me love them even more. But I will have them linked down below. And then here's also a discount code if you are interested. And I'm going to finish packing my backpack so that we can head out to Namanju. Quick little outfit check. And I have on this very cute skirt, but I feel like this covers most of it. But we're going for a very monochromatic look today. Oh, got it. making a quick pit stop at the supermarket so that we can bring some fresh fruits and other foods over to James' family before we get there. It's also raining today, so weather's not very good. We're actually having a debate on what to get them because it's always really difficult to find presents for Asian parents and Asian grandparents because I feel like they have such particular needs and not lack of needs like i don't think asian parents really prefer flowers at all unless it's like an actual tree um and then my parents always love fruit so things like grapes these are really big they're huge wow peaches are so pretty wow. there's only one two Oh, 
We are at my grandparents' house and we are all getting lunch with my aunt, my uncle, my grandparents and we're just walking down. Next month. Next month. Next month. Next month. Next month. 우리 동네? 우리 동네. 음. 여기야. 여기야. 음. 맛있다. 맛있어요? 응. 음. 맛있는 거잘 샀어. 네. 민경이 음. 공항을 빠져나가려잖아. 가방에 음. 전부 주고 가자. 이런 생각 했을 때 찍어. 요즘 사람들 같으면 요거밖에 없어. 결혼식? 응. 이게 30년이 다 돼가니까 이게. 너도 몇십 년 만에 보네. 그래요? 몇십 년 만에 봐. 나 그래서 내 친구들이 그만해. 그럼 전화 오셨어. We woke up to me and Kurumi and James, but I'm doing some editing right now before we get started with the day, just because I have so much work to do, even though I'm not working working, I still have content stuff and I wanted to take the two weeks off, but I just figured it'd probably be best for me when I get back. Kurumi, Kurumi, hello, his name is Cloud. In Korean. Kurumi. Kurumi. Ah. Mwah. Mwah. 
We'll be back. Oh my god. Hey. Go. Go. Hello. Hello. Come on. Oh. He said no. Morning. We're going to Paris Baguette or the nearest bakery to grab some little baked goods before we go to leave with James's aunt who graciously allowed us to stay at her place with her cute ass dog Kuromi. So yeah. James is in a sad mood. I'm not in a sad mood. I am in a great mood because I'm in Korea. <laughs> <laughs> Cheesecake.